If you are catching a flight today, airlines are warning that you should be prepared. It is expected to be one of the busiest days of the holiday weekend, and there could be some headaches ahead. Our Pauline Lee live this morning at MSB International with what people are worried about and what one company, a company a lot of us depend on here, is doing about it. Pauline? That's right. One of the biggest companies, Delta. So we've been keeping an eye on the arrivals and departures, still hanging steady at 10 delays and one cancellation. All of it has to do with Delta flight. So if you take a look at the check-in line, boy, what a difference does a half an hour make? I mean, half an hour ago when we checked in with you, we were about two and a half rows deep in for check-in. Now this line barely exists, so it looks like they're keeping up with check-ins. But Delta expecting it's going to be so busy this weekend. It's asking you to think about changing your flight. The airline issued a travel waiver, allowing customers to rebook any flights starting tomorrow through the 4th of July free of charge so long as that travel route stays the same and that new flight takes off by July 8th. This comes as the company expects a record number of travelers since the pandemic began. Now travel waivers are usually weather related but experts say this is a sign that Delta and other airlines aren't necessarily prepared to meet the surge in flying demand as COVID wanes. Travelers we spoke with say this makes them a little nervous. It, it is concerning and hopefully Delta can handle the influx of allowing changes and the pilots having enough staff. And she mentioned pilots there. Delta pilots are actually expected to pick it starting at 10 o'clock this morning here at MSP. They're calling on a wage increase and a change in flight schedules. Now, what happens if your flight is canceled or maybe you're bumped because your flight has been overbooked? Well, what are your rights? Do you get any money back? We're going to talk more about it. We'll have some tips coming up in about half an hour, Heather. Right, looking forward to it because those are some big numbers there. All right, Pauline, thank you. Mm -hmm. Now, while some are flying, millions more families will be hitting the roads this holiday weekend. AAA expecting a record number of Americans to be driving. The group is predicting 42 million will take a road trip 50 miles or longer for the holiday weekend. And that means you could run into some congestion on the roads. Travel experts are recommending that anyone who's traveling today or tomorrow should start driving early or wait until later in the day. All of this coming as gas prices hit record highs earlier this month. So if you do need to fill up this morning, these are the new averages out just the past few hours. Minnesota, 470 a gallon, a little bit cheaper. In Wisconsin, 466. Both of these prices at least a few cents lower than the record highs that we were seeing just a couple of weeks ago. Today